Okay, so now the water is very strong and it will be, you know, the, it will dig the soil. Every day, every day for my my farm over here. We have a lot of tree here, and I it need the water every day. So I always do it exercise like this. But sometimes I'm not here because I'm busy. So today I decide to make a drum pump for this farm, and it is for my option. If I want to pump, I just pump. But if I'm not, I don't want to pump. I just open the drum pump so let's see how I install the drum pump and I have a very special trick with this installation so please watch right away okay today uh, actually I make a, a stall for in, for stand this drum but today I just use double drum one is for for the stand for the standing stall and Another one just top on here and okay so I got another one. Okay, so now it's already firm and I already punch no this is the original hole with the 60 millimeter and this is the output that I have to just make it direction to the to the farm away over there and the intake is the other side here, just uh, 34 millimeter, and I will direct to that river, just suck from the river, and this one just go out over there. So I have to install right now. Okay, so we start to do it. Okay, so uh, now I install the intake water pipe.
All right, it's firm now. So we start to connect the pipe. This is the, the, the part that we have to install the, the water, to fill in the water at the first time. So if we don't have this one, so we can't install the water because uh, the other side is for the air and this is the water. So the, it just runs like this, the water inside, the air go up there, over here. So this one needs to be closed when we open the output water pipe to make sure it sucks. So now the intake, I. I have to install the intake pipe. Okay, so as actually this is the food valve check that we have to install at the last intake pipe to reuse the water going back. To, this is the one way, one way valve check. Okay, and great. We have to fill in the water into this pipe before we connect it. Okay. Okay, the water is here now. Okay, so before we connect is direction and go pie I have to get direct it to my farm over there oh blue must be okay so uh, we need to put the air pressure, this is the empty pie only, but we put as the vertical and it is very important for air, it won't reduce from the output, reduce the bubble from the output. So we need to put it every project. But I have to use the glue first. And use the other glue spawn. It's a little bit hard for me. I'm fine. Okay, so 
so that now I need to fill in the water until pull the drum until pull. So I just use my special pump to restore the top pump. I put this one a 34 millimeter because to make it balance from the intake water pipe. My intake water pipe is 34 millimeter, so the last one I just keep it balanced because the sack will be use the 60 millimeter. But okay, so this is the 34 millimeter. It's balanced with the intake water pipe and this is 60 millimeter most people asking why we put the big one and the last one is a small one because this one is the gravity to make it heavier so it press the the tank because of the water have uh, the water weight is heavier than the intake water pipe so the intake will suck and the last it it will come out with a 34 millimeter so i'm going to open the drum is pressed now it's almost deformed because the water go out very very strong so I can hear the water dropping now I can start to hearing water dropping just now because you know it's very very strong press the water go out very strong so let me see the last Little bit, one, two, and three coming. Wow, very strong. Wow, it is working now. What's very strong? Maybe I have to put the plastic over there because otherwise the water will will dig the soil go through over there. Oh my god, it's strong. Okay, so now the water is very strong and it will be you know it will dig the soil 
over there so I can see them too. Hi. What are they my plan? Oh, okay. So I put this one. The pie is already broken, okay. Okay, so now I got the water. and the way and I will prepare something to cover the pipe <laughs> okay are you aware that this is the, the way that the people traffic around so I will make something like the wood like here just make it easier for people who riding by this way but okay so next video you will see that it that is already done with this one so now i just live here like this first just a bit tired so i just want to see the other the drum in this side and no leaking one five okay so i can hear the dropping sound and it's no leaking a little bit but it's not much okay I will use the glue to, to reduce some leaking a little bit but seems like the water just dropping into the drum it's nothing nothing serious but it almost deformed already as you can see one like shock shock it's almost deformed but it's it's no problem because the river level is not very very low it's not very deep so it could be sucked by this drum, not before. So after what it's getting, we can do it about 4 or 5 meters, we can do it. Just make sure that the output water is long and big to make it heavier and press the drum so the, the water will come up like this. So for today's video, is about to finish and I hope you enjoy with our tutorial with this drum pump, with this idea. and. If you are the first time watching our channel, please feel free to subscribe, like and comment, share this video to your friends if you want them to know about free on the free anti-water plants using drum pump. Bye, see you again with the next 